Hey guys, this is ViperX420 of pureglitching.com and today I'm going to show you how to successfully install a desk counter into OBS. So what we're first going to do is we're going to go to autohotkey.com and we're going to download autohotkey. I'm just going to download it here just to show you guys. Once it's downloaded, we're going to click it, click yes. Now that it's open, we're going to install auto hotkey. So we're going to click next. I agree, next, and then install, which will finish the insula uh, installation process, which I already have completed. So I'm not going to click install. We're going to cancel that. Now that we have auto hotkey installed, we have to make a few files. So for me, I put mine in my overlay stuff. And as you can see, we have one file called deaths, and the other file is death counter script. Now, I actually use this for something a little different. I don't actually use it for death counter. I use it for games completed during my marathon Mondays, which would make it a lot easier for me to add another game completed to my segment. But it's same exact uh, stuff. So what we're going to do is I'm going to create a new folder in here just to show you what I did. Let's edit this quickly and copy, which I'm actually going to take this and paste bin. We're going to paste that just like that, okay? So what you guys are going to do is you guys have to change just this one line to go where you want your files to be, right? But for now, uh, I'm just going to leave it like that. And we're going to submit. And there we go. So now we got a paste been made up for you guys. I'm going to put this in the description for you guys. So all you have to do is go copy. Now we're going to make a new text document, we're going to call it debts. And we're also going to make another text document called death counter script. It can be called anything you want, but it has to match how it's scripted. Now that we have this, we're going to open it up and we're going to paste the script that we just made. Now, let's just assume uh, you don't know where your file path is right now. Well, for now, because I'm doing it in new folder, it's going to be here. When you click up here, it gives you the actual file path of where your files are. And then you just copy it. And paste it over there. And now that we have that, slash deaths.txt, just to finish it up because that is the name of our file that we are going to be using to update. So let's save this. Let's close it. Now what we're going to do is we're going to open it and save as all files a.ahk, which equals auto hot key. Save. Now it's saved. Once that's saved, we're going to go into deaths, and we're just going to put a zero here and save. Close. Because if you don't put the zero in, it will not work. Keep that in mind. Now that everything is set up here, all we have to do is click on this, click run script, and now it is running. But we got to test it out. So we're going to come over here into OBS, and we're going to... Click Add Text, OK. Use text from a file. Browse. Completed. New folder. We're going to use our depth. And OK. So now we got our zero right here from our little file. And now we're going to push F12. And as you can see, every time we push F12, it goes up. And if we push F11, it goes down. So now, if you really want to get more fancy, now you can start doing custom text, stuff like that. I'm just going to use impact. 
and we're going to give it red with an outline of white with four thickness OK. So now we got our number. Let's give it something to actually explain what it is. So death counter. And again, we're going to go with impact red. Use an outline of four. OK. And there we go. Now we got our death counter. And we got our numbers. So now every time you die, you just push F12 and it will continuously count it up until you're into the thousands and thousands. So I hope this tutorial helped you guys out. Woo! I don't know what the hell happened there. It's going way over. <laughs> That's what happens when you hold the button. Try not to hold the button. Try to uh, just push it because stuff like this will happen. If something like that does happen, just go into your folder, open up deaths. You'll see your deaths here. Delete it, push zero, save, and bam. It's all fixed. It's an easy reset. So I hope this tutorial helped you guys out. This can be used for multiple different things. It doesn't have to just be a death counter, like I said. But at least now you guys know how to set it up. Uh, I'd also like to thank, um, let me try and find this here. Yeah, death counter script. There we go. I'd like to thank, however you say this name, <laughs> D. Hickson for making the wonderful tutorial and the script that I used for this tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed. Until next time, this is ViperX420 signing out. Till next time, take care and have a wonderful night.